Well, their homes are less than 10 years old, and residents say they're already falling apart. Some people who own townhomes in the Waterford Complex in Clearwater, they blame the builder, KB Homes, for all the problems. Now, this isn't the first time that the builder has been under fire. 10 News has reported similar complaints from people in the Willowbrook community in Manatee County. And some of the residents from Manatee are now lending support to the Clearwater residents in their fight with KB Homes. It is reporter Catherine Burr. She's covering Pinellas County. She's live at the Harn Boulevard Complex. You know, at first glance, guys, this place looks great. Nice new town homes, attractively painted, but you take a closer look and there are some signs of problems here. Now about 30 residents are organizing. They're complaining about shoddy construction. And as you mentioned, these folks are not alone. There have been similar complaints from other neighborhoods built by KB Home. All right, here's another example. Gail Beaulieu is a crackerjack tour guide of cracks. It just fell off the building. But pointing out building defects at her townhome complex isn't the way she wanted to spend her retirement. Absolutely not. This is very stressful. Beaulieu and other Waterford residents complain about problems inside. You can see this is all moldy. And out. You can see the, the bulging coming out of the wall because of moisture damage. But there's more. So this press board is just rotted, just coming apart like potato chip. Through the window of this unit, you can even see metal poles helping support the second floor. And if this all sounds familiar, it's because 10 News has reported about similar problems at the Willowbrook neighborhood in Manatee County, where Dan Keeler lives. Wow. He came north, moisture detector in hand, to lend support. This is exactly what we're having problems with in Willowbrook. Water intrusion, failing structures, uh, mold growth. And the common denominator in these two neighborhoods, the builder, KB Home. It's just a sad deal. It's a sad deal that this many people are having problems. I keep calling them and calling them, but I don't get anywhere. The Homeowners Association has already spent $14,000 on an engineering report. There's pictures after pictures. That blames improperly installed stucco and flashing for water damage in the units. Basically, our buildings are just falling apart. It's a slow death. And homeowners here want KB to fix the damage, but they say so far their dealings with the builder have been frustrating. Late this afternoon, KB Home issued this statement to 10 News. KB Home is fully committed to taking all the necessary steps to ensure that every home needing repair is repaired. We've been actively working with the Waterford Association and the appropriate contractor and engineers have already started the process for the repair protocol. We appreciate the patience and cooperation of the association and homeowners, which will allow us to take the proper action. And of course, 10 News will continue to watch this situation to see if KB Home does indeed make the repairs. Reporting live from Clearwater, Catherine Burst, 10 News.